sir. You're oh! right. The Cherokee Heritage Center ended the month of March by hosting Indian Territory Days. For two days, students had a chance to be involved in hands-on activities, games, and demonstrations for school-aged children with a focus on Cherokee life as it was in the late 19th century. Perfect, guys. You guys okay? Squeeze and turn, squeeze and turn. Beautiful. Keep it, finish it. Demonstrations in pottery making, basket weaving, and finger weaving showed children the unique Cherokee lifestyle of this time period. Students from Talking Leeds Job Corps Center volunteered their time to help with the activities. I thought it would be a cool cultural experience and to learn more about my tribe and where it originated from and to just help out a bunch of kids have a lot of fun. Students participated in Cherokee cultural games such as blowgun shooting, stickball playing, marbles, and even chunky. I think the kids have an extraordinary time uh, because they have uh, such a free place to roam, run, and um, they have the opportunity to play stickball and to play chunky and marbles and to weave a basket and to pinch a pot so it's a hands-on opportunity that not a, they don't get at a lot of other places. All the important decisions that the people made would be discussed and decided in the council house. Storytelling was held in the Diligua Council House, and students had a chance to learn a little Cherokee at the Swimmer Schoolhouse. Cow, waka. Waka. Chicken, jitaga. Jitaga. Very good. Students who completed seven of the ten items on a list had a chance to pick out an arrowhead to remember their experiences by. The next student activity will be Ancient Cherokee Days on October 5th and 6th. Students will step back 300 years into the past and experience life in a Cherokee village. For more information, contact Tonya Weevil at 918-456-6007, extension 6161, or by email at tonyaweevil at cherokee.org.